Hey, it's Dave, Savage Subies. I just wanted to talk real quick about tuning your Subaru Turbo at the wastegate. Um, this is your wastegate, <coughs> and it's got a vacuum line coming into it, and it controls the valve um, that opens and closes to build up the boost on your turbo. I know most of you guys learn this stuff in grade school, but there's still quite a few people who are just now starting to learn about turbos and basic setups, and it turns out there's not a bunch of videos that explain this real clear. So um, basically, here's how you tune it. There's an adjustment here, and you got a jam nut, so you, you break that loose while it's still attached. You've got a C-clip. Pop your C-clip off. Um, you might want to get some spares, because they are easy to lose. If you have a, uh, if you just push with a screwdriver and you put your thumb behind it to trap it and grab it, it's pretty easy to pull it off if you're careful. You can use a screwdriver to pry it up a little bit, too. That's what I see a lot of people do, but then it wants to pop off and disappear. So I recommend pushing on the bottom corner of the clip until it just pops off and you have your finger here trapping it and you should be able to pull it right off. Uh, this thing's a little too warm to do right now. Uh, and then right here you adjust this and so what you'll find is that there's kind of a neutral spot where it's closed and, and then this drops right over the pin and that's kind of your zeroed out reference point and you can kind of go half turn forward, half turn back and kind of turn tune it lightly right there. And what tuning it by going a half turn back, that's going to be more like a, a more efficient tune, your economy tune. And by mid range, and then half turn forward is like your your performance tune, right? And that's kind of like all the tuning a stock, like a factory tune, like a tech might do. But um, some people who are into cheating the system have learned that we can turn this thing up one maybe two turns on a stock engine maybe a little more if you got a little more work done on the motor or you just don't care and what that's going to do is that's going to cause your turbo to build up more pressure before the wastegate closes all the way and that's giving you know full boost so a little more lag a little more top end and that's the balance and so the more you dial it out the more it comes on early but you get less top end and the more you thread it in the more lag and the more top end you get. So depending on the type of driving you're doing, you know, this could be super helpful.